Hey everyone, it's your friend Think Noodles, and welcome back to the Noodle Planet! Where today we're gonna do some stuff up here, and also down in the uh, in the base below. Um, I did a little bit of off-camera work. I cleaned up the mess from Sparky. Not that he exploded, but you know the the rail tracks and stuff. Uh, I also um I I put some blocks underneath uh, that beacon there, so that that is now a speed two beacon. So it extends almost to the front of the ship. It, you know, it gives me a little bit more of the speed two. Uh, function which I really really like as I think it's my favorite beacon effect but um oh and another thing we need to do we're not doing it in this episode because I don't want to play with anything that explodes I kind of want to take it easy is we need to put some more creepers up here and I got to thinking about it and it was really dumb because when uh, mobs first started um, well when, when mobs were, were when it was announced that mobs that were killed by supercharged creepers would drop a head or a skull, I guess. Is it a skull? Yeah, I think a skull. I don't know. I don't know if it's a wither skeleton skull or a creeper skull. I think it's a wither skeleton skull and then like another creeper head, a skeleton head. I'm not sure. But either way, um, it's just, that's just terminology. But uh, when, when a certain area got struck by lightning, so say like right here, if there was a creeper like within like, I forgot what it is. I have to look it up. But like, I think it was within like three blocks so it'd be like one two three and then all the way around one two three like that that would be affected i don't know if it's three or two uh but they so what i should have done is what i'm trying to say is that i should have put more than just sparky up there uh because if it struck like right there almost the whole head at least in the first layer would have been affected and we would have had multiple charged creepers uh and i would have put them in like i should have put one there 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 and there maybe have four um I'll have to look at, at how it works again, uh, but next time we're putting multiple creepers in there. So if we do finally get another lightning strike, and we may never get one again, uh, we'll get more than one creeper. <laughs> that I, I don't I don't know why it didn't occur to me before, but it didn't, and I'm really disappointed in myself. So we're up here where um, where I chew where I've got the dog and cat chooser, and uh, I want to actually add a step three, um, and I want to start using this more too. So I'm gonna put step three right here. And uh, step, oops, step three, take potion. Ah, well, you just cap, put caps lock that. So there we go. And then again, step three. Yeah, I was like, huh? I didn't okay. Take potion. And uh, the potion that I want. Well, you guys can see it here. So let me. I'll just put one there and one there. Well, actually, I, I have some being well. Anyway, uh, oh, and the button, obviously. We need a button um, on top. There we go. So that's just when I take the pets because a lot of time I take them underwater, under under here, and I get worried they're going to drown, so I like to have water breathing potion uh, just to get them down there at least. Um, and I was making some more. Let me just grab the others. I think I, I was making two at once, although they aren't very far along here. Okay, they're just awkward potion for now, but uh, I was working on it. Um, and you know what? While that brews, let's see. Yeah, while that brews, let's go check out the Golden Noodle Award. And it goes to uh, Mr. Schmello. And guys, you can see the fan art on screen right now. First is the comic, which is on screen. You may have to pause it to get to, uh, to see everything there. And then is the uh is is it's me and Kopi uh and I just love this drawing style it's amazing and then the final one has to do with Sparky and the last episode that we had here on the Noodle Planet and this art blew me away amazing uh let's get back up to the potions here let's see okay we've got water breathing now we need to extend them we'll extend there and extend there and then oh and then we need some gunpowder there we go and come on come on come on come on let's make it a splash potion hurry up ah i hate waiting for potions and that's why i have two of them i should you know i should make a potions room oh you know, and, oh i've got a really good idea too we could we could put a witch in there i mean like not loose but we could put her in, like at her own little brewing stand would that be cool I wonder where I could put that though. I mean, uh, probably down below. That that makes the most sense. But uh, but this has been our potion room for so long. But it doesn't necessarily need to be. Uh, all right, here we go. Yep. Boom, 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 and done. 
Cool. Okay, now we've got quite a few in here, and I'm gonna end up throwing one at myself because I always do that with splash potions. When I'm like, when I'm doing PvP, and then I, I'm supposed to like hit someone with like a po poison, poison two, it always hits me. Just always. Okay, so let's choose our pet today. Choose our pet today, and it is a kitty cat. All right. Okay, who are we choosing today? It Tom. No, Tom's already. Well, okay, Tom's already down there. Oh wait. How come socks? Socks! Did you take your name out? Huh? Huh? Well, I, I guess we'll take Tom. Tom's already down there, so. Uh, and I guess I don't need a. Uh, ooh, it's nighttime. I better take a nap. Oh, uh, let's look for name tags. Should we look for name tags? Let's look for name tags really quickly here. Um, I th think I have one. And if I do, we can grab a creeper or at least just trap him uh, for moving later on. Let's see, uh, here? Yeah, here's one right here, okay. Um, bum, bum, bum. Beautiful sunset, look at the beautiful uh, rainbow. Oh, I'll, I'll go through and say hi to the dogs. Hey guys, hey, how's everybody doing? Kofi, why are you facing the wall, girl? You're not in trouble, hang out with everybody else, come on. All right, there we go, that's a little better. Um, okay, so I don't even know what to name this one. We already did Sparky and that one made sense. Um, but, you know, we're gonna have to name a bunch of them, and we only got one, huh? Alright. Uh, let's call him... Let's see, um, we'll just call this one... You know what? They are kind of sparkly, so we'll call this one Sparkly. Not Sparky, but Sparkly. And obviously Sparkly is gonna be a girl. Uh, okay, I need some blocks, though, to block her in. Oh, wait! Wait, wait, do I have any more... Oh, I don't have any more invisibility potion, do I? Hmm. What did I... No, I think I used it all, you know? Let, that's... You know what? Let's just put it here. We're gonna leave that there. This is not a good idea. It's not a good thing to do um, without an invisibility potion. Because that seemed to work pretty well last time. Uh, well, uh, um, that did not work very well. <laughs> Get rid of that. Um, no, so the last time that worked pretty well, I got pretty close to them and I could... Probably, I mean, I, nah, all right. Let's just save that for later, especially if I, I gotta do some AFK fishing to get some more name packs. So where was this? Uh, I guess it was here. Jeez, what a mess. Okay, so uh, no dealing with that. Uh, but let's see, and I fixed that. Oh, right, duh. Kind of, so uh, I saw something on the detail craft subreddit. And it had to do with, uh, well, hey, Tom, come hang out. Um, so it had to do with kind of what I'd done here. Um, and uh, I played with it a little bit, and it seemed to work. Uh, I, I think I came up with a little bit more of an idea as well, but we need to we need to repopulate these here uh, because my wife took a couple. There, okay, so they're, both, they're, all, they're all four full. Okay, good. All right, so let's go over this way now. Um, it has to do, again, with the way that armor stands work, um, and that, uh, they are sort of, um, entities, but you can, you can manipulate them, put them inside of things, which is important. Uh, and I saw, oh, and I saw some really cool stuff as well, uh, that, um, also on that subreddit that I haven't really, uh, thought about just yet. Um, so let's grab a few different types of glass here. Uh, not clear though, because clear has those lines in it, and I don't like them. Um, let's see. Oh, I need pistons. Pistons right here. Ah, uh, well, we can take them all. It doesn't matter. Grab the redstone. Um, what else did I want to do? Uh, oh, yeah, okay. Well, okay, so a couple things that I wanted to do here, um, and uh, I hope this works and I don't have to disassemble these completely. So, uh, one thing is, I wanted to move this... Oh, really? I thought I'd used... Oh, okay. Alright, that's fine. Uh, so, okay, what I want to do is... Um, oh, okay. Let's get, let's get redstone lamps, because you guys will see why in a second, why I need one, and I can't just use that one. Um, let me just put it underneath here. So, I wanted to move this... Well, wait a second. Eh, do I really care? Yeah, I do, I do. Because uh, I was going to say, we're not really going to be able to see it, but you kind of can. So, where's that redstone torch? We'll use that. Uh, and we'll put that. There we go. All right. 
And get out of here. Now, uh, let's see. So I break this one. Okay, yeah. So if I break this one. Well, I, I didn't mean to use that. No! Ah, oh, I did it wrong. Oh, I'm going to have to disassemble them anyway. I just realized. Okay. Because, um... Where's... There's the hitbox. Okay. Uh, so I wanted to put... I think I want to put black... I don't know what color glass. Uh... Okay, and then... I, I'm trying to see how I... No, I don't like that so much. Is this the silk touch good? Uh, how about instead we use gray... I like that. I like that. Okay. And then that's, let's try white. Let's see how this looks. Nah, I want something more clear than that. Uh, and that's gray. How about black? I mean, black might look cool. Wait, let's, let's, um, let's close this off so that we can see what it will look like. Let's see. Let's see. Um... Mm. No, you know what? Let me reverse that. Reverse that. Uh, so put this here, then put that and that. Okay, I like that. I like this. I like this. Okay. Uh, no, you know what though? I hold on. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry, I cannot decide here. E I like that because it looks like it's lit. Yeah, it looks better that way. Okay, so this, I, I think I'm settling on this. Oh, and okay, well, we can do it that later. Okay, so let's take this back. So I, I decided on that gray glass there, and I don't have a lot of that, do I? Is this one right? Yeah, not this one? Not light gray? Yeah, no, okay. All right. Okay, so what we need to do is put the armor stand back down here, and I'll put it like that, and then <laughs> my pants. Uh, okay. Oh, wait. Why am I taking them off? Let, we need to put those in the right place here. Okay. All right. So, put that there. Put that there. Put that there. And put that there. All right. Good. Okay. So, now, this is what you do. Uh, you can, uh, let's see. Let's get a piston here. And I'm probably going to have to take out that block there, I think. Yeah. Uh, and then I put a piston here underneath. Like, come on, get. There we go. Facing down. And then I take the gray stained glass, and then I put, here we go, block of redstone right there, then break the block of redstone, and you guys see that? Cool, right? And then I put another one, and block of redstone there. All right, take it away, and it's inside the casing. Isn't that cool? Now, I want to see if, can I take stuff off? No, you can't, right? No, you can't. That's okay. It's not like I really use this stuff. I mean, it was just for display. And then, um, and then I want to, well, I need some more gray stained glass. And I, uh, do I have, um, yeah, of course I do. I've got tons of ink sacks, so we can do this. Uh, ink sack, ink sack, yeah. All right. So we'll make a little bit more. Um, I've actually, this is like way too much, in fact. Uh, but it's fine. There we go. So we got gray dye. And then we've got some glass here, right? Don't we have some glass? Clear glass, yes, okay. And we'll make ourselves a bunch of it. I mean, we might as well, it's, it's a good color anyway. Uh, okay, so, uh, so then we just need to repeat that. Oh, oh, and then, um, oh, Tom, get out of the water. See, this is what, this is what I don't like with you guys. Get, no, no, oh geez, oh geez. Wait, do I have it, do I have it? Oh, I don't even have it. Tom, get over here, get over here, get over here. He's gonna drown, he's gonna drown, he's gonna drown, he's gonna drown. Tom! You're not allowed to go over there. Sorry, bud. Um, <laughs> I just don't trust my pets in the water. I just don't. Um, <laughs> okay, so, uh, and then, uh, let me show you guys one more thing with that. And I don't know if I'm gonna do it. I think I'm just gonna use black. Uh, but you can put carpet on top, too. Um, and you just have to, well... I'll show, oh, let me put that back too. Um, so what you have to do, and I'll just, um, here, fine, <laughs> it doesn't matter. Uh, so normally you would want to put the carpet directly on top, but I'm right clicking, you can't. But what you can do is uh, you build like next to it, like, ugh, there we go. <laughs> you look at the red, ah, redstone there. And then if you build on here, nope, that's the wrong thing. <laughs> uh, if you put it on here, then you can put it on the side of the carpet. You see that? And then it stays. 
So then you can go ahead and break that and break this all back down. And I think black is a good look. I'm not sure just yet. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I like that. Yeah, that looks really, really good. Okay, now we just have to do it, well, a few more times. Uh, and let me see. Should, uh, okay, well, let's just, I can never find a hitbox on these armor stands. It's so, there it is. Really hard to find. Uh, we'll break that. We'll go down one. Do, do, do. Um, and then, yeah, this this is going to be really nice. I, I I like this look a lot better. It, it's a lot, um, it, it's a lot more of a display than, than before. I mean, before it looked cool, but now, I mean, it's like, ah, I love it. Ooh, yeah. Oh, wait, let me get that carpet too. I don't have a lot of those. Uh, let's see. Let me put this one. So let me, let me show you guys again. So here you go. I, I'm sure you guys caught it, but I, I don't know. I, I like to, ah, I like to narrate myself doing things. So, <laughs> uh, okay. So yeah, you put the armor stand or you put, you put the base because, uh, if, if I didn't and I'll show you guys, well, I think you saw it. If, if, if I don't put you know, it, the armor stand just falls. They uh, operate with gravity just like just like sand. So if you want to do something, you want something underneath it, you have to put it underneath first and then put the armor stand. Uh, and since I was changing out that block, I had no choice. Uh, and then we go ahead and take out this block. Yeah. And actually what I... Uh, no, no, you got to do it in that order. I was going to say I could put the redstone block, but that, that won't work because uh, the piston will extend. And uh, I won't be able to put the uh, I won't be able to put the glass. So there we go, and there, and then break it, and put another one, and boom! Yes, number two, all done. Let's see. Oh, let's see here. Nice, nice. Okay. Uh, let me just do the other two off camera for a second. I mean, because it's gonna. Oh geez, that was that was the worst way to do that. Okay, I'll be right back, guys. There we go, guys. Check it out. Isn't that awesome? I mean, it's it's a really cool thing that you can do this with armor stands. And and I I worked with the lighting a little bit. I, I don't think there's really any dangerous areas. I mean, maybe right. I thought yeah, right there. I think that's the only one. Okay, two. <laughs> okay, well, maybe need a torch right over here or something. I'll figure something out here that we can, but uh, but but I want to make it so that there's like light enough that this doesn't spawn anything. But I want this, and I'll just take it out now to look sort of more dramatic, so that like if you guys notice, right, you, you see the lighting glitches up there, which is fine, whatever. Uh, but you know, it's like kind of dark, and then all of a sudden it's like whoa, you know, like it lights up. I mean, it, it's kind of more drama to it. Oh, actually, watch. If we do this. Uh, let's go to, so if we go to here, like, moody. Now you guys will see that. See? That's what I, ah, see, that's what I want. I want that. Whoa. That, that and that, that's how it would be in, uh, in moody, I guess. Um, but no. Right. Bright, bright, bright. We like bright. But, uh, but yeah. Uh, which it, it's kind of like, you know, this map here where it's just like, whoa, this thing's so bright, you know, but the rest of it's kind of dimmer. Um, what? Why would I? That is just ugly. There. Jeez. Uh. Okay. So yeah. Um. And then the other thing. Um. That I that I learned about the armor stands. Although we're not gonna really have time for it. Is um. Is you can. Okay. Is uh. You can. You can display armor stands or armor stands. You can push things like stairs into them, and uh, and make them look like window bars, which I want. I think I want to do here um, instead of this. You can make like so. What it would be here? Let me show you guys uh, just uh, an example. I, I'm not gonna. I, I'm not gonna put this. I'm not gonna put the. Um, I don't have a. I don't have a uh, an axe with me. Yeah. Um. So I'm not. I'm not gonna put the armor stand in because it takes some piston pushing and stuff like that to do it. But basically, you would have a window like this, right? this oops not like that like this good job buddy what, what, what are you doing what are you doing you oh my goodness all right let's try this again there and there okay like this uh and and right through here you would have um you would have an armor stand you know like well where's an armor stand we have one here i saw it before 
Uh, which one are you in? I know you're here somewhere. Here? Why can't I find you? Ah! Forget it. <laughs> oh no, but they got armor on this, so you can't really tell. Well, you know how the armor stands have the sticks? It would just show the sticks through there, and uh, it would be, instead of like a full square of fences, it would be like these like nice tight um, armor stand marks. I think it's pretty cool, and, and I think we'll put them here just to see what it looks like. Uh, obviously, I'm not gonna use this type of stair, but you could use anything. You could even use um, stone stairs, doesn't matter. And uh, it is a really, really cool effect. And there's a lot of things you can do with armor stands that I'm learning, and I'm gonna start using more, but I think this looks pretty amazing. <sighs> so I think it's time to find some name tags, do some AFK fishing, so we can be naming some creepers in an episode soon. I hope you enjoyed this episode on the Noodle Planet. If you did, guys, please go ahead and, oh, geez, I thought, I thought there was like a hole in my block, but it's just a piece of stairs. Please do go ahead and pick up those chopsticks and poke that like button as hard as you can. I'll see you guys again soon. Thanks for watching, and of course, Noodle Line.